My reason for going to church was really to please my parents and to gain value from them. And I thought that I was gaining value from God and earning His approval by being a good moral person. And going to church was just the right thing to do. I never like went to church or anything. I kind of just claimed I was a Christian. You know, I just said I was a Christian without really knowing it, but all along I was actually lukewarm without really knowing it. I used to curse a lot, and I used to battle with alcohol and gambling. I knew I was missing something in my life, um, because you can have everything. I mean, I have my home, I have my children, I have my job, um, everything is good. But there was something still that I, that I needed to, to complete me. It was peace. It was a peace I can't describe, just an incomprehensible peace. At that moment, I just saw a light. Like everything was just a weight lifted off of me. Everything was beautiful. And when I was in church, I felt like Pastor Ed was talking right to me. And I don't know why, but I was crying. I was crying. I've come to the end of myself. I can't do this life alone without you. And that's the moment when I prayed and received Jesus into my heart. In which I prayed to take our Lord Jesus Christ as my Savior. And it was at that moment that I prayed to receive Christ. And Jesus Christ is my Savior. We went up to the praying room and I received Christ. And from that moment on, my life changed. I know I am forgiven. I know that I have confessed my sins. I now know the truth that God says I am worthy, that I am loved, and I am chosen. I have a thirst to know what He says about me, that He is who He says He is, and I am who He says I am. You know, I know when I put my trust in Jesus Christ as my Lord and Savior, at that moment, He did give me a new heart with new desires, no longer wanting to sin. And you'll find Him, because He's, gonna, he's going to meet you. He's there.